Over the past year, I've had the privilege to produce podcasts featuring some of the biggest names currently on the internet. And in that time, I've been able to get my editing speed through the roof. So for about an hour and 20 minute podcast, it'll take me about two and a half hours end to end for the rough cut, getting out all the dead spaces, changing out all the angles, intro, outro, thumbnail, and fully exported. But what if I told you about a brand new AI plugin that takes that number and shrinks it to minutes, if not even seconds? So the software I'm talking about is called Autopod. And what it does is essentially creates your multicam sequence for you and switches automatically based on who is speaking. Let me let that sink in for a second, because if you too have ever edited a multicam with, you know, three or even four camera angles on a podcast, you know, it can be quite time consuming to find the right time to switch to make sure you get the right moment. Now, this is a paid software, but they do have a 30 day free trial. So when you're ready, head on over to autopod.com, enter in all your credentials, download the software. It'll automatically be installed into Premiere, import all of your footage, and let me show you how wild this is. Okay, so here we are in Adobe Premiere. I've got my two angles here, just a snippet from a recent podcast that we produced with the curator CEO, Jimmy Mackin. And I'm gonna go and import these onto my timeline one at a time here. We've got Jimmy's angle and we've got Byron's angle. Pretty easy so far. I'm gonna make sure these are synced, which they already are, but just for good measure, we can go over here. And now everybody's in sync. Now here is where Autopod comes in because instead of making these a multicam sequence like you would normally go about doing, it's just a few clicks. So you go up here to Window, Extensions, Autopod Multi-Camera Editor, and that'll pop up your little window here. You'll sign in and here is where it gets cool, right? So the cutting method, I wanna do enable and disable. This will allow me to go back in and re-edit in case I don't love the cuts that were made. I like the shot frequency as medium. That just means how often the shots are gonna change. We have two speakers and two cameras. So on audio one here, we have Jimmy. On audio two, we have Byron. And the video one is also gonna be Jimmy and video two is gonna be Byron. Pretty self-explanatory so far. What have we been here? A minute and a half, not even. All you're gonna do now is just click create multi-camera edit. Let it do its thing, it'll start encoding. And now let's watch this in real time. No cuts, watch how this happens. It's gonna start doing its thing. And how nuts is that? It is live editing the angles of the podcast right in front of you. Right now, this is just a little snippet about 10, 12 minutes of it here, but it is doing it in real time. Boom, Autopod multi-camera editor has successfully completed. If we watch this back, Byron's talking, goes right to Jimmy, goes right to Byron, goes right to Jimmy, goes right to Byron. And that is probably the most impressive part of this entire software, because look, when it's just long blocks of one person speaking, followed by a short pause, followed by another person speaking, very cool, neat party trick, it'll save me some time. But when there's two people and they're talking over each other in quick succession and the software knows, First of all, that's horrifying, okay? Let's just get that right out of the way. But second of all, this 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 took nothing to do. Now, this is not to say, let this do your whole edit completely. I would still watch it back and maybe two times, two and a half times, just to make sure that there's no other angles that you wanna cut a little bit better yourself if somebody's making a salient point. But on the whole, this just takes out so much busy work when you're editing podcasts. Do I think this is gonna replace podcast editors? No, actually this is the first AI that I see the tool usage of that is gonna save me time. So in the same time that I'd usually be able to edit and produce two podcasts, I can now edit and produce 10. Less downtime equals more content output. This is one of the coolest new AIs on the market and it just takes a couple clicks to get up and running. If you're new to podcast editing, especially in multi-camera sequences, I would still go about learning how to do it the old fashioned way just to be able to build that muscle. But if you're a pro and you're like me and you're producing you know, five to seven podcasts a week with video content involved, yeah, this is gonna save a bunch of time 
and time equals money. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. Is Autopod the greatest invention ever, or is it Skynet on a diet? Whatever you think, I'd love to hear about it in the comments. Leave a like, leave a subscribe if you found this video valuable. See you next time, and always be creating.